but this one comes via Snapchat. Hi, doctors. I would like to know what is the difference between laxatives and stool softeners, and which one should I use when? <laughs> this is a really good question, and we're going to send this to our proctologist on call, Dr. David Rosenfeld, joining us now via Skype. And, and Dr. Rosenfeld, I got to tell you, people are often really confused about what to take when, when it comes to things like laxatives and stool softeners. There's an overlap between laxatives and stool softeners, and I want to keep it really simple. Let's talk about constipation that if you are pretty regular every day and you don't go to the bathroom for two days and you feel it's stuck, then you've got a bullet that's not coming out of the chamber and you need gunpowder. That's the laxative, like a stimulant <laughs> laxative or a mechanical laxative. So the, the milk of magnesia is the magnesium citrate, Seneca, Cascara, uh, Bisacodyl, all those things will push the stool out. A stool softener is for someone who has constantly firm stool. It's hard all the time. When we take a stool softener, it mixes with the stool, softens it, and then helps it come out soft. I will tell you that if you're really constipated, don't go to the bathroom for two or three days, the softener is not going to work because the stool in the rectum is hard. It's sitting there, and it's getting harder and harder, and it's not going to get down to that area and make it soft. And really important, if you don't go to the bathroom for two or three days and you're feeling cramped, but you need to see me because I may have to help get it out. It, is, it can be a dangerous problem. But Americans are constipated and because we don't eat enough fiber. Mm -hmm. Adding one dose of psyllium fiber and more water every day, you'll have a pot of perfect poop. <laughs> Solid, soft, and clean. Yeah. And also probiotics. Probiotics are good bacteria. Most Americans have an imbalance. We have more bad bacteria. When we get that back into balance by eating the good bacteria, the probiotics, it can help us have a soft, regular bowel movement. But that takes about two to four weeks to work. That's Dr. great. Roosevelt, Dr. Roosevelt, always yeah. full of great yeah. knowledge. So Thank you for that. And, yeah. and the important takeaway is that if acutely you use stool softener or laxative, that's okay. But too many of us have become dependent mm -hmm. on these Good things. Point. And that is not the overall solution. If you're having problems with your bowel movement, talk to your doc about it.